The Keller School District has doubled its growth within the last 10 years. 31,500 students. 51 square miles. 34 campuses. And Keller ISD is not finished growing yet. There's still uh, parents and students coming into our system all the time. We anticipate about 40,000 students within the next eight years. We did have wireless connectivity at all of our campus facilities. The limitation was that it was not a robust network. What Keller was trying to do was to try to be able to get a wireless implementation in place that could actually handle the, what we call the capacity or the number of devices that are actually required to be connected on a network at one time. We couldn't do streaming video. The students really couldn't take full advantage of all the software we had at their disposal. So it was a real problem for us to try to incorporate technology into curriculum when students really had to be wired to a computer to be able to use the software and all the technologies that they had available. The Motorola 802.11n technology with the switches, the RFS 7000 switch technology was ideal to be able to meet those requirements. We had an idea, we had a thought about what we wanted to accomplish. we are continue to build new schools um, that will rely on the work that we've done. Uh, with Motorola, with this wireless system. We've had to make some very big promises up front to Keller with this technology and these access points and these servers and the software. Speed and reliability are very, very important to us and we were promised that and Motorola came as our partner to help us with that. We use the, the Motorola Land Planner software exclusively for uh, the design of our wireless network. The Motorola software was instrumental in allowing us to identify the, the correct number of APs and their location because we, we did not have access to all of these locations beforehand because of the school environment that we were in. We just simply could not be walking into schools uh, that were being used. What was really nice is that after we began actually doing some of these walkthroughs after hours and verifying how accurate the land planner software was. Security on a wireless network is a very big concern that we have. Before our Motorola wireless solution, we had rogue networks throughout the district. A rogue device can really bring a segment or even a whole network depending on the configuration to its knees. When we installed the pilot for Motorola wireless through their air defense part of the program, we were able to locate rogue devices that were on campus that we've been searching for for a long time. And it's easy to maintain. Our support costs have gone down tremendously by having air defense. Anything that comes up as a rogue device, it can basically shut it down so it's not having any issues on our wireless network. And so the security aspect became a big part of our decision to go with the Motorola wireless solution. The Motorola Smart Branch solution has provided a lot of flexibility for us. What the Smart Branch uh, solution brings to us is, is a way to quickly deploy a wireless network to, to an area. Our internet may be down for some reason, our students may not be able to access the internet for some reason, and we can set that up. It's a very small footprint, um, gives us in-speed wireless networking. For instance, our internet access can become severed for one reason or another. What we can do then is we can deploy a wireless network to an area where students are, are conducting a test online, quickly give them that access back to multiple computers so that way uh, the students can continue their testing and without interruption. In fact, we just used it recently in a situation where we were doing network upgrades and the wireless was down for a weekend, but we had to have that connectivity. We were able to set it up in minutes and students were able to have full in-speed network by using a wireless card from a provider and they had full functionality of our network. I think education is all about solutions. I've never felt it's about this product does this or this product does this. It's about a solution. Keller Independent School District partnered with Safari Montage during the summer of 2009. We wanted to deliver full motion video to mobile devices, to the PCs and the Macs in the room, to other remote mobile devices in large quantities. For example, 30 students in a room looking at a mobile video might be looking at the same video or other. So the challenge here and what we did with the partnership and the development side of it was to build that and test it and come up with a model where we could deliver videos at different rates at different times across their network. I go out to campuses and the teachers are excited. They're like, this is great, this is what we've wanted, thank you. You know, they're, they're glad that we can provide this and it's working for them. So they're excited and so that makes us excited. It's about delivering what needs to be delivered to students and that's a, that's a great, great feeling for a school superintendent. Uh, to have that level of partnership. I think the key that I see with Motorola, they want to work with partners, they want to work with customers and develop a solution. Motorola 
has worked very hard with us at Keller on a solution. With our new Motorola solution, we have coverage area throughout the district. We're, we're running a pilot right now where they have a netbook in every student's hand during, during class. When Joe talked to us about we were going to connect all of these laptops in the classroom at one time, I kept asking him, really, this is really going to work? And he promised me absolutely it was going to work, and it has worked. It's been flawless. Now with the new network, we're able to access it through eye touches and personal computers and really anywhere in the school, so it lets us work more freely. We'll have upwards of 60 to 70 teachers in one place, all on their laptops without any concern of whether or not they can connect. We're looking to expand the wireless network in various ways. One of the things we're most excited about now is having GPS and wireless on our school buses. We're currently implementing a pilot right now for our students to maintain that connectivity after they leave the school. And all of our school buses having internet connectivity on the ride home every afternoon. In addition, the wireless access points have GPS capabilities, so our transportation department will be able to monitor the location of our buses and provide an aspect of safety and security for our students as well. As far as expansion um, possibilities for our department and for the district, I, I think those are um, endless possibilities. We'll be able to allow our first responders to tap into our communications and in the event of an emergency, you know, time is crucial. The second thing this will be able to do is allow us the ability to migrate towards um, fully wireless IP security cameras. Additionally, this will allow us to move towards RFID technologies to allow for automated attendance, which will save our teachers a great deal of uh, time. We're working right now with our maintenance and operations department to find out how we can maximize the wireless network and monitoring of all of our energy management resources. We're looking at wireless remote access for lighting controls, for heating and air conditioning, and all kinds of cost-saving measures. As the district continues to try to do additional things, better things, it's to transform the way we use technology and transform the way that we teach kids. And so uh, it's a springboard for us, I think, to, uh, to help us to do greater things and it gives us an opportunity to share what we've learned. Uh, I think that's the, the, one of the best services we can provide. We stand on the backs of many districts that have tried things that we have uh, catapulted, I hope, to a new level. And I hope we will continue to have that kind of relationship with districts in Texas and districts across the country because I think working together uh, the goal is to make education a more meaningful experience for kids. Uh, it's not about the technology, it's about the instruction uh, and the capacity for our kids to utilize the right tool at the right time uh, to know the things that they need to know to be successful. And so uh, we've been catapulted forward uh, as a district and, and we, we like leading from the front. That's a, that's a good thing for us.